Barista Maniac back with another specialty roast. Today's coffee is from Thanksgiving Coffee Company from Fort Bragg, California. Draped like a patchwork quilt over a steep winding ridge, the 2,000 farms of the Dukundi Kawa Cooperative stretch over 10 kilometers of meandering hilltops and slopes in the northern Rwanda. On small farms of an acre or less, families produce beans, potatoes, plantains, and coffee, which is the backbone of their community. The community of farmers collectively known as Musasa, after the area's main town, produces one of the most elegant coffees in the world. During the harvest, the farmers gather ripe cherries at a central processing station where the fruit is removed. The beans are then fermented overnight and then carefully washed and dried. At Thanksgiving Coffee Company, it is a means to an end. It is a medium by which they strive for excellence. They have been building their concept on the basis of great flavor for 36 years. Flavor is their foundation, the giant stone blocks at the base of their company culture. They love the taste of their coffee because they understand the inner qualities of coffee and have learned how to bring out the flavor in the roasting process. It also helps that they have come to understand some of the chemistry of the flavors. Did you know that there are 1600 identified chemical compounds in a single green raw coffee bean? Specialty coffee has become the coffee that cares, according to Thanksgiving Coffee Company. It's not just about the product, but also about the people who produce it and those who consume it. They are proud to say that after more than three decades, their coffee is not just a cup, but a just cup. This is Barista Maniac. Thanks for watching. Mama, hey, mama.